Hello everybody, my name is Jamie from the Worthy Homestead and this week we are camping at Palina Lake Campground at Palina Lake in Oregon and we do lots of hiking during our camping trips. Mom, I got them off. We catch Stop. bugs Mom, I got them off. and we go swimming and we fish. Right oh, behind me is Palina Lake. And right up there is Polina Peak, which is about 8,000 feet. And we hiked that yesterday. So I hope you enjoy our mini vacation camping video. went to Crescent Lake for the 4th of July. We always do a long, a week-long camping trip. Oh, this year we decided to switch it up and went to Palina Lake. There are many things to do at Palina. Yeah. It, it is the Newberry Volcanic Monument area in Lapine, Oregon. This time I had a good friend come and join me and the kids camping our first night. So I didn't get much video but I did get photos and the first things that we did when we got there is let the kids jump in the lake. Okay, go girl! Ah, that one got away from me. Ryan's coming, he's gonna jump! Are you gonna jump? I'll hold it! Move, Ryan! I'll hold it. Ryan! Go! Hey, Ryan, are you gonna do it? Oh, Ryan would never. Nope. I think he would. Okay, come. Boy, boy. Oh. The first one was like... So of course that night we had s'mores and when we woke up the next morning we had breakfast and we decided to go see Palina Creek Falls. Palina Creek Falls is located just west of Palina Lake outside of the Newberry Caldera. This double falls drops 80 feet over volcanic cliffs into the rocks below. Later that day after lunch, of course, we went to see the Big Obsidian Flow. At a mere 1,300 years old, the Big Obsidian Flow is the youngest lava flow in Oregon. A one-mile interpretive trail climbs up and onto the impressive lava flow of obsidian, which is like black glass and pumice. It is located within the Newberry no National Volcanic Monument. The next morning, I hiked at Palina Peak with my cousin, which was a pretty epic hike when you ended up on top of the world at 7,984 feet in elevation. I know it's not on top of the world, but it's pretty high up there when you live at 700. Palina Peak is the highest point on the Newberry Volcano. This site offers a grand overview of the Newberry Caldera, the south and west flanks of the Newberry Volcano, the Cascades, the Fork Rock Basin, and much of Central Oregon. On a clear day, the Cascade Range is visible, extending onto California and Washington. If you don't want to hike to Palina Peak, which is six miles out and back, you can also choose to drive up there, which is what I did with my children later that day, so they could see the great view also. The next day, I wasn't quite sure what to do with my kids because everyone else in our group was busy, so I decided to take my three young children on a hike around the Palina Lake which is a loop trail and is seven and a half miles. How are you doing, kids? Hiking across around around the lake. What lake? I don't know. Palina. Palina Lake. Actually, don't need a yell. Are you a camper? Yes. You're a dirty bird. You're He's a dirty bird. bird. You get messy. All right. We've got about six miles left. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. Here in the Newberry National Volcanic Monument area, you have to pay for parking. It's usually a $5 parking fee, but if you have the National Forest Pass that you can buy annually, that covers you at every location here at Paulina Creek Falls, the Big Obsidian Flow, 
the parking area at the lake, and everywhere here. So to be sure, pick up the National Forest Pass yearly so you can save money. I have a link of where you can get one down below. Our campground is over there. So far we've hiked all the way over here. We're about almost the two miles into our seven and a half mile hike around Palina Lake. There's a bunch of fishermen out too. It's kokanee season. Come on, where are your kids? Go get your kids. By walking around Plina Lake, we were able to see the Plina Lake hot springs. The hot pools at Plina Lake are primitive to say the least, typically feature circular pools within the sandy banks of the lake, where some pools are bordered with rocks and wood. They were filled with green algae and I do not recommend soaking in them. If you don't want to do the whole seven and a half mile loop, you can take the short trail, which is 2.8 miles straight to the hot springs. We have made it to the Pine Lake hot springs and the kids are touching the really grilled one. See where the logs are? It's where the hot springs come out. Actually, this part of the water, you can tell is warmer. Jade likes it. <laughs> yeah, you see it bubbling? You can tell Auntie saw the hot springs. She wanted, she told us to go and look. See it bubbling? Cool, huh? All right, guys, let's keep going. The other ones we saw, uh, I think that we, on our trip with Auntie Amanda, you saw the ones that were like rainbow? Like, oh, uh, the Yellowstone. Yellowstone, you saw the ones that were like rainbow. <laughs> yeah. But yes, they, I don't remember what they're called they right had now. Rules that said do not touch. Do not touch the because of the sulfur, huh? Yeah. yeah. All right, ready? Let's keep going. <laughs> They're all walking away. The hike is amazing. Come on, this, come on Jade. Look at all the obsidian, guys. Yeah. There's this one section of the trail that is just goes straight up and it's all Obsidian and the kids are going nuts for obsidian. Yeah, we can't take it. But it is illegal to take it home and it is a $500 fine if they catch you. So leave the obsidian so everybody gets to enjoy it. Really hurts. King of the Mountain! Hello everyone. Today's our last day. And so I decided, I knew I would regret it if I didn't run around the lake. So that's what I'm doing this morning. It's a sunrise run. The sun actually is back over here. It hasn't even came up yet, but coming up on Paulina Peak. It's just so quiet out here. Only a few fishermen are out. 
and the ducks. But this is my view this morning, and we're gonna head to the rock slides, which I hear are really cool, and that will be it for our week. I hope you enjoyed my Huayna like video. Like you may be wondering where my husband is, Jared, the father of my children. Um, we are fine, everything is fine, but dad is a very sweet dad. And he's going to jump out of an airplane. And he is super sweet and so sweet that he opted to stay home and let all of us, the rest of the family, go camping and he's taking care of the whole farm all by himself and going to work every day. So, honey, I love you. You make everything worth it. And we really appreciate you. Hey, Cash. Hi. Tell me about your camping trip. <laughs> it was great. What have you done so far? Um, went... I'm driving I'm up that mountain and uh, um, I forgot. You went up to the top of Palina Peak. Mm -hmm. You hiked all the way around Palina Lake, which was seven and a half miles. Mm -hmm. You rode your kayak on the lake. Mm -hmm. And I did rock slides. And the rock slides and the big obsidian flow. That was cool with all the obsidian. Yeah. Yeah, we've done a lot since we've been here, huh? And we've gotten ice cream twice. <laughs> yeah. Is that your favorite part? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We, we might get it three times. We might. And what are you having for dinner tonight? Sloppy Joe's. Is it your favorite food ever? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then we get to go home tomorrow. Yeah. Then... When we go home, we gotta get our new puppy, which is called Max. Surprise, surprise. Next video will be us getting our new puppy. So, subscribe, check it out. Goodbye. Bye. Make sure to be there. Make sure to be there.